When I think back to my, my days in Iglia, the first word that comes to my mind is empowerment. Iglio to me means um, young people coming together. It's just an extension of, of my family and... Personal relationships, uh, friends uh, that, that I met back then and you know, you're still in touch with today and you keep in touch with for, forever. Iglio gave me a European family. I've left Iglio a much truer version of myself than I when I joined gave me my own voice in a way, it helped me to form my voice. I remember my first time in the European Parliament here in Brussels was with Iglio. So I was doing the administration, I was uh, reporting to funders, um, I was um, doing a lot of fundraising, I was organizing events, and that has helped me a lot in my work today. I know I can call certain, certain organizations and there's someone there who's been at Iglio, and you're like, you made a connection. It is for many, many young LGBTIQ people still, I think, a very first entry into international activism, European activism. It's about giving young people a space and a voice. People coming together in ICLEO often um, uh, have, have just come out, so it's important that they um, are able to come together in, a, in, a, in an environment that supports them. It's just great to have this chance to speak up. It was one of the, I think, most, one of the most pretty life-changing experiences. I'm getting almost uh, very touched now. <laughs> we're all over the place, we're, we're influencers and Iglio continues to do that. Keep up the great work, that's all. <laughs>